Uh, actually, I'm looking forward to uh, Chris coming. I mean, when was the last time you, did, you like really talked? Oh, we really talked? Yeah. I don't, how did that go? I was struggling and having a really hard time. With what? Your transition and this like leaving us in the dust. Nobody's leaving you guys you in left the dust. Us, you left us in the dust. Why who? Basically, I'm just saying I went Nobody's through a hard time. Nobody's leaving anybody, I'm not going anywhere. You know, it was like, what happened to just the life we had together? It's like, you don't, you just threw that away. I thought it went pretty good. But then after it was over with, I kind of, uh, I, I kind of struggled with it a lot because, you know, there's a lot of emotions there. Well, yeah. There's 23 years of life together. Mm, that's tough stuff. Do you, yeah. do you feel a little on the, on the defensive or self-conscious with her at all? Do you... I always felt on the defensive with her. Okay, that's a different question. Um, <laughs> there's just another element here that I don't quite understand, which you know, I'll hopefully have some time to talk to her about. I feel sometimes now she gets more upset than she was when we were together, you know? Um, uh, and I don't understand why, because she was, I was very honest with her and open with her. Now, sure. You said about trans stuff? About, yeah, about gender issues. But if I was your ex-wife and I loved you, it would hurt my feelings. What has to happen in order to improve your relationship? I, I don't know. You know, most couples who get divorced, they're, they're kind of done with each other. So I'm more than a little worried about what's going to happen. At some point in your life, you got to move forward. No trip. It's always an adventure when you travel with me. Your friends are amazing. <laughs> Not you, Jenner, just your friends. <laughs>